Detective Comics issue 988 sees Batman investigate what looks to be a simple murder case, but the Dark Knight knows better. Jim Gordon thinks with everything Batman has done recently that this case is a little beneath him now, but Batman says that this is a mystery and he is a detective and doesn't need to be told what to do by Jim. Gordon reminds him he's the commissioner and he's kind of taken aback at how candid Batman is being recently. The two put aside their differences and get to work and Batman learns the name of the man is Harold Frank. Batman takes off looking for Harold's apartment. He contacts Alfred who is surprised since Bruce has been out of contact for a long while. Bruce says that he's okay and Alfred agrees and after everything that has happened with Selina he's also proud of Bruce. Getting to the task at hand, Bruce has Alfred look up Harold Frank and says there is more to his murder than meets the eye. As Alfred tells him all about Harold who is just another ordinary man in Gotham, Batman looks around his apartment and spies a secret door behind his bookcase, leading to a room filled with maps and guns. Not long after finding the room he is attacked by a female firefighter. Fly. As the villain attacks him with her flamethrowers, Batman tackles her out of the building as Alfred tells Bruce that the Firefly's name is Bridget Pike, one of Ted Carson's protégés. Batman grapples Firefly, tying her up to the building's fire escape and using her leverage to get back inside the now burning building, helping some of the people out of the smoke-filled apartment block. Ted Carson, the male Firefly, is downstairs burning the building from within when Batman attacks him. Alfred wants to call in help, but Batman tells him not to. The building explodes and Ted gets away within the fiery wreckage, leaving Batman to call Gordon, telling him the fire department is there and helping the people. He tells Gordon that Harold's murder isn't a typical murder and the fireflies were involved, possibly getting rid of evidence in the secret room of Harold. Batman still isn't sure so he will keep on digging. Elsewhere, Cobra is alerted to Harold's death, but it doesn't matter to him since he and his men got the data they needed from him before he died, meaning that the Cobra can rise again. Detective Comics issue 988 was a fun back to basics detective story for the Dark Knight as James Robinson stops by to help get the book to its landmark 1000th issue. I really like that Batman is finally back to just solving murders and working with Jim Gordon and kind of burying himself in work to deal with his marriage being called off. Even introducing a new Firefly to Batman's rogues gallery was cool and hopefully they stick around. I'm really looking forward to a good mystery and I think this book's going to deliver on it. I'm going to give this issue a 9 out of 10. Hey everyone, thanks for watching my newest video. If you enjoyed it, you might also like to check out my other reviews here on my channel. You can also follow me on various social media platforms like Twitter by searching Matt underscore FOS or even join the Comic Multiverse Discord server and chat with other comic book fans including myself and Joel from Cape Joel. Want cheap comics and trades? Head over to the book depository with the link in the description to get the cheapest trades and comics around along with free shipping anywhere in the world. Until next time, this has been Matt of the Fortress of Solitude. Thank you so much for watching.